Hi, this is Peter Dart's Clairvoyant here, and, and if you don't mind, I'm sitting in my car here, and, and I'm doing uh, a quick reading for you here. Um, but as you know, I don't need my tools, you know, I just um, sort of speak my thoughts, so to speak. And sometimes it's it's a bit odd, sometimes with family stuff and busy doing my reading, so I've got quite five minutes here, so I just thought I'd do one of the readings while I'm sitting here for some quiet time. So, this is your daily tarot reading here for the 3rd of October 2019. And I'm just being drawn for today now, as if to say, to just get yourself organised and motivated. And think about the things that you want to sort out for the day. And and I feel like as you do that, you're going to get yourself really kind of motivated and pushing yourself forward and organised. And I feel so that's good because I feel like if you don't start off organised with things ticked off, I just get the feeling the day seems to run away with you. It's like time goes by. It's like me rushing about. Whew, where's the day gone? Unbelievable. And and it's like that. So it's like having a tip box today, getting yourself sorted out, getting yourself motivated, getting yourself organised. I've got to do this. I've got to do that. And then before you know it, hopefully you've got most of these things done and you're sorted and you're organised and you'll be feeling good about it. And I think that's the way forward for the day. And that, and I feel like as you implement that, perhaps that strategy through the rest of the days and the week and the months ahead, I just feel so it could really help you to get sort of a lot done. You know, because sometimes we set out to do these things and it's like, by the end of the day, it's like, I haven't done this, I haven't done that. It's like, where's the time gone? It's unbelievable. So try and get yourself a bit sorted out. Keep an eye on a young child around you. I say young, sort of teenager, but I want to say roughly from 11 to 15, 16. And, and I just feel like they sort of seem to be giving you a bit of trouble, a bit of sort of back chat or whatever it may be. But I just feel that they're in that period now where they're growing and changing a little bit. And they're just testing your patience a little bit. So try not to lose your temper too much with them, but just keep an eye on it, keep it in check. Don't let it run away with you. And again, sort of I've got this uh, feeling of letting things run away with you. And it's going back with the child as well. So... Just keep an eye on that a little bit. Okay, excuse my phone beeping off here a little bit. Um, and what else do I feel for you for the day? Right. Um, I'm also being drawn to sort of some things to do with family. I know we've touched on children there, but family. And I feel so certain member family is needing your help. But again, sort of fitting in with the time frame, it's like, have you got the time to do it today? They may be demanding they want your time now, but have you got the time to do it? So you'll have to sort of reassure them that you'll be popping over later. Or maybe you've just got to sort of perhaps sort of saying, look, I'll be around tomorrow because I'm, I'm busy to uh, can't get out I can't do this you know I'll be there tomorrow and you know sometimes people have got to be a little bit patient around you you've got your needs your busy life it's not just about running around after them think everybody thinks we can just drop everything and we can't can we so just keep an eye on that a little bit okay and then I feel so with work just watch that you don't sort of have a bit of aggravation with your boss you know it's like I feel so you could be feeling frustrated with your boss or maybe your work colleagues and and I feel so try not to lose your temper try keep you cool and then as you do that you should be absolutely fine but if not it's like, it's like you've just got to try and bite your tongue but if you feel so you've got to say something then fine you've got to say something but just watch that it doesn't get a bit aerated so to speak because you don't need things escalating so just be careful of that and one or two of you as well I feel like you've got migraines today or headaches or something or you could be feeling laid up the flu being drawn to your head your eyes your forehead so keep an eye on that a little bit but you'll be all right but it's going to knock you a little bit one or two of you might feel like you need the day off and stay in bed or something but you know just sort of judge it on how you're feeling okay but other than that i feel as though you should be fine so I hope all that kind of makes sense for you. Well, you probably won't know until the day if you're reading it today for tomorrow, will you? Uh, but if you're reading it on the day, hopefully it does make sense to you. And, and I hope you can take sort of snippets of that. And if you do want a private reading with me, 
please do get in touch. I'm here to do those for you. So have a great day. Have a lovely day. And, and I'm with you on that one. I've got to get myself organised as well because there's things I've got to do. And sometimes time just flies by, don't it? So yeah, so please do like and share this uh, video uh, with your friends and your family. Please do subscribe to my YouTube channel. That helps me to grow. Really appreciate that. So yeah, so tune into the next one. Thanks very much for listening.